was in 2008 that unfortunately our family, me as mom, received some really awful news about a diagnosis that my daughter Allie had. And it was really at that moment that life changed. I was in the beauty business as I went from mascara to medicine. I decided to start the Guthrie Jackson Charitable Foundation and then I was gonna find a cure for my daughter. And it's been 15 years of this extraordinary journey. It was so important to me that I start a community, that I really started to find the other people all across the world that were struggling and suffering from this to start building a network. I love the idea of this artistry in motion where people are receiving this kit and they are all coming together, whether it's online or I'm sure there are some people that get together with their friends to paint and express themselves through color. The idea for artistry in motion sort of blossomed out of that need for process-focused art making. And so the art therapist that will be leading this workshop will go over different techniques to use and sort of will guide everyone through their process of creating and will invite different ways to explore different materials, to try different techniques out. And process-focused art really challenges that idea of like there's a right way and a wrong way to create. Um, process-focused art focuses on the experience of the art making. And arts and wellness is more around the overall benefits of self-expression, the relaxation, the self-confidence that it can build. I lost my identity of myself. I lost my job, I lost my car, I lost my house, I lost the ability to walk, I lost everything completely and had to start all the way over. So I didn't know who Amber was anymore. I got an email about the Artistry in Motion class and that it will be like an online Zoom class. I just remember being so excited because they said that the materials would be free, that they would be delivered. I've joined the Artistry in Motion class and I felt like complete crap. I joined it anyway because I know I'm gonna get that encouragement that I need and every time I get it. They're so kind and they're gentle and they teach you to be gentle with yourself. And it picks me right back up. I found out that there was nothing wrong with getting the help. You know, it was nothing wrong with saying, I need, I need help. And the last place that I thought would help me feel so much better in terms of my mental stability is the art class. I mean, something so simple as, you know, this art class that I'm doing has taken me from that sad, lonely, depressed state into a bubbly, more free, happy, smiling Amber. We did a survey following kind of the pilot program of this artistry in motion. And what we were hearing back from a lot of the participants were really awesome and positive things. They were experiencing a decrease in sadness, decrease in isolation, feeling more connected to community, a decrease in anxiety, and also we were hearing a decrease in pain. For me, one of the biggest blessings of being a part of these programs is seeing people make connections in their own individual experiences that help them feel less alone and less isolated. I think because we are all really wired for connection, it's important that we stay connected. And whether that's artistry in motion, whether that's walks in nature, whether that's meditation, I think it's critical that programs like this stay in place. And I think it's what's missing in medicine today is we need to have more of beyond the science, we need to have the art because so much of medicine really is about the intersection of art and science. This is just an art class, you know what I mean, to people on the outside, but to the people that's on the inside, this is everything. This is our lives. Thank you so much for giving me that hope again, giving me that confidence, that will to live, not to just think about the bad stuff that's to come but think about the good and the joy and what I can create and what I can add to the world. It can be something very simple, but it can uplift them. And so it's given me purpose. It's helped to bring back purpose into my life.